All right, ladies and gentlemen, get ready for five rounds of full rules Muay Thai out of the 112 weight division. Fighting out of the red corner, she's wearing the black trunks and representing Rajasi Muay Thai with a 5-5-1 five, five, and one record from Boston, Massachusetts, Jeanette Pitbull Galusian. And fighting out of the blue corner, she's wearing the black trunks and weighing in at 112 pounds. Representing Henzo Gracie with a 12 and 5 record from right here in New York City, Ann Lieberman. Five rounds of action are set between Jeanette the Pitbull Galusian and a Boston, Massachusetts on the left side of your screen, and Ann Lieberman making her return to Friday Night Fights after more than three years away from the promotion. We're so glad to have her back, representing the Henzo Gracie Academy, and an immediate push kick from Lieberman to start the action against Galusia. And Lieberman with an impressive record of 12 and five, Galusian at five and five, as well as one draw. She takes tough fights, does Jeanette Galusia, known as the pit bull out of Rajasi Muay Thai in South Boston. Yeah, she's tough fights. Every time I see her, she's against an opponent that is, is really strong. It says a lot about her. And know, this, she's not scared of anybody. This is an official away game for Galusian, the Boston native taking on the fan favorite in her own backyard in downtown New York. Very technical is Ann Lieberman. I mean, great Muay Thai coming out of her, catching a kick, you know, paying attention to what she's doing, picking her strikes. Body kick gets in there on Galusian. Goes up high with the right leg, does Lieberman. Outside leg kick for Lieberman. Another one. Methodical attack so far by Ann Lieberman. Yeah, those are going to start to add up, those leg kicks. Stiff right got in there, though, for Galusian. Solid. Stumbled Ann back a little bit. This fight. Scheduled at 112 pounds. Galusian had a tough weight cut down the end. Had to jump a lot of rope in the gym at the weigh-in yesterday. So tough for these fighters to have to cut those last couple of pounds right before getting in the ring, especially with an opponent like Lieberman who fires off a back elbow out of the clinch. Big spinning back elbow. But Galusian content to fight in a phone book with Ann Lieberman not backing down a bit. Wrestling match breaking out here in the final moments of round number one. Lieberman going up high there in the final seconds. And some reddening on the left side of Jeanette Galusian's face. Good work there by Ann Lieberman. Good to have her back on Friday Night Fights. Yeah, it's great to have her back. Strong first round. She came out strong. She finished strong. Put Galusian under the guillotine right away. Immediate pressure applied by the woman formerly known as the Pocket Titan. She doesn't go by that nickname anymore. Her old pal Gavin Van Vlack anointing her that some years ago. But Ann Lieberman very humble, not, not the type of person to gloat about herself or her skill level, even though she could. What's amazing about Ann Lieberman, the facial expression doesn't change throughout the entire fight. You see the same look on her poker face, face throughout. Yeah, Absolutely. Poker face. Laser focus, and Jeanette Galusian. We saw her fight just recently on Friday Night Fights, a little over a month ago, our last show here at the Broad Street Ballroom as Galusian fires a leg kick to start round two. She lost to Noriko Villar. And that was a great and fight. She, that was a tough fight. Another una one. Unanimous decision loss, but she really fought valiantly. And we're happy to have her back on this show as well. As Lieberman catches the left leg. Stands right over afterwards. Shoves the pit bull down. Straight right gets in there for Ann. Ann wearing all black with the blue elbow pads. Belusian with the black trunks and gold stars and the red pads. Ladies are exchanging leg kicks right now. Galusian up for the battle here against the established Dan Lieberman. Body kick caps off a nice combo by Ann Lieberman.
Luzzi, a nice job corralling the leg of Lieberman there. Left hand got in there for Ann. Again, representing Henzo Gracie Academy here in New York, a Pittsburgh native, but now calls the Big Apple home. Big New York crowd for her tonight, too. We hear a lot of cheering. She has an outstanding fan following here locally in New York City. Lieberman sticking and moving here down the stretch around two. Two inch height advantage over Galusian. And Lieberman five foot three. Galusian is five foot one. And now the damage starting to show a little bit on Galusian's face. Not necessarily huge power shots, although right there, Lieberman finds home with the back elbow. Lieberman's start, Lieberman starting to pick the pace up a little bit. And dig it in with some elbows. Finish right that in. round strong. Big Finish time. That round strong. Big time elbow combination by Ann Lieberman tripling up on the forward elbow right at the end of that second round. Right little bit of a bell. little bit of, of a knot on the left side of Galusian's face right now. Doesn't yeah, it's showing a little redness, but she might just bruise easy, so I don't think that should play too much of a factor in the judge's eyes. But uh, finishing that round, Ann Lieberman really, really had to steal it away. She, she finished really, really strong. She's We're been solid throughout this entire fight. We're scheduled for five here between Lieberman and Galusian. And yes, that elbow did land, looked like right on the ear, possibly. And James Guccione, you've taken some big shots on the ear in your day. Cannot be a good feeling. No, it is not. Kevin Mohal prepares the fighters for round three. Galusian. Boy, she is ready to go. Although she eats a right-legged teep as the bell sounds. And runs right back into traffic against Ann Lieberman. These girls, the ladies are standing and exchanging, exchanging punches. A strong clinch. Cross face grip now for Ann Lieberman on Jeanette Galusian trying to bully the shorter fighter. Nice elbow over the top for Ann Lieberman. Right over her guard, landed a solid right elbow. And Lieberman undaunted, unafraid to step in with that elbow against a shorter fighter. She's been exerting her will so far. Boy, Lieberman peeling off that clinch and looking for a major blow with the back elbow again. Lieberman is extremely tactful right now. She's picking her shots wisely. She's landing them. She's finding a target. There's not, not many shots are going on un, unnecessary. Lieberman continues to come forward and stagger Galusian. How much more can the pit bull take? She's in tough for, for the entire fight so far. She's been on the receiving end of shots like that. Short elbows and straight left hands from Lieberman. Yeah, they're sneaking through. And the worst part for Galusian, trying her best to stay on the inside and fight Lieberman. But if she backs off, then Ann can get those legs extended. Lieberman is just coming in with really, really nice combos. Punches and kicks together, finishing strong every time. A little frustration on the face of Jeanette Galusian, but boy, is she hanging tough right now. She's hanging tough, but anything she's doing is getting shut down. And uh, But you, know, you can see the frustration on her. She's still in this fight. She's a technical fighter. She's a skilled fighter, but uh, Ann Lieberman's got an answer for everything she does. Ari Lagami with James Guccione ringside for the Broad Street Ballroom. We're through three rounds of a scheduled five between that young lady and Lieberman, who just fired off that mean right elbow against Jeanette Galusian, and then a left later on, switching him up on Galusian as the third round wore on. Seen a little bit of everything from Ann in her return to Friday Night Fights after a more than three year absence from this promotion, and the crowd here at the Broad Street Ballroom could not be happier to have her back. 
Round four coming up now at 112 pounds. Lieberman looking for the sweep, or the dump, I should say. Again, bullying Galuzzi with that cross face. And Lieberman doing everything right in this bout so far, and she cannot, but she can't get Galuzian out of there. Boy, Jeanette Galuzian tough as nails in there. Taking some knees to the body now from Lieberman. And Lieberman's been on the attack here as she fires another back elbow. She's ready with that. Every time there's a little space in that clinch, she's ready to do something. Head kick sneaks through for Lieberman. And Jeanette Lieber is still pushing forward, though. She, you know, she's not backing off at all. No matter what she gets hit with, she comes forward right afterwards. And Lieberman representing Henzo Gracie Academy. Here in New York City, Jeanette Galuzian out of Rajasi Muay Thai in Boston. We're gonna see her teammate fight a little later tonight, Elvin Johnson. Sing Dom, as he's known. We're looking forward to seeing that as well. Right now, we're watching Galuzian and Lieberman. Round four of five. And again, Lieberman with that cross face. Stifling the breathing of the pit bull. Big punches out of Lieberman now. Kick again for Lieberman in the final 10 seconds of round four. Galuzian fires off a couple of knees there right before the bell, but another strong two minutes for Ann Lieberman. Strong round for both ladies. I mean, once again, strong round for Ann Lieberman, but Jeanette hasn't backed off at all. You know, both these ladies aren't showing any signs of exhaustion. They're, they're pushing forward. Another great crowd on hand, as you can see here at the Broad Street Ballroom in New York City. Friday Night Fights brought to you by Mohegan Sun Resort and Casino, and that's been the go-to move, the back elbow for Ann Lieberman several times throughout this fight so far. Big right kick there, too. We've really seen most of the arsenal from the woman formerly known as the Pocket Titan putting it all together here in her Friday Night Fights return. But boy, Galusian does not quit. No. Give her so much credit. Less experience than Lieberman fighting a hostile crowd in addition to a hostile and talented fighter. And Galuzian with Lieberman every step of the way. We'll see if she can get through this fifth round. Well, Galuzian unfazed by the earlier attacks. He's coming forward here, reaching with the leg kick. And Lieberman coming out in southpaw position. Luzian tries to go inside with the leg kick. Jeanette got in the left hand there. Tries to skim the elbow across Lieberman's jaw. Lieberman ready to clinch. Again, Ann Lieberman 12 and 5. Nice, nice right elbow, sneaky right elbow out of Ann Lieberman. Luzian responded with a right to the chin. Up elbow there for Lieberman. A lot of elbows landing for Ann in this fight. There's another one. Under a minute left of this battle. Again, Lieberman looking for elbows. Galuzian able to spin her around, though. Yeah, she's got to be careful when she turns her back like that. You know, every time you throw that back elbow, you know, you're exposing your back and you're, you're putting yourself in jeopardy. Another sneaky elbow by Ann Lieberman. But Jeanette just shakes it off like it was nothing. Tough. 
Well, they don't call her the pit bull for nothing. Jeanette Galusian battling, scraping through five rounds with Ann Lieberman in her Friday Night Fights return. You can tell which way the crowd wants it to go, but so much credit going to the kid from Boston, Mass, Jeanette Galusian. Yeah, she stood there and went five strong rounds with Ann Lieberman, who threw everything at her. You know, she used all of her arsenal. You know, great round kicks, sneaky elbows. They were all landing solid. It was a great fight. Marvelous effort from both fighters. Over 10 minutes of action here tonight. That was Lieberman just a little stronger in close quarters, James. And those inside elbows, boy. Yeah, Lieberman she, made it a point to stick those in whenever she had a chance. Right chance there. she good. She snuck them right in. And that was the one moment where Lieberman kind of put herself in jeopardy in that fifth round. Our ring announcer, Connor Hall, has the scorecards. We go to him for the official decision. All right, ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds of action, we do have a winner by unanimous decision, New York City's own Ann Lieberman. Well, a marvelous performance for Ann Lieberman and the crew from Henzo Gracie Academy. We see Ann for the first time in three plus years on Friday Night Fights, and tremendous respect as well to Jeanette Pitbull Galusian and the crew from Rajasi Muay Thai in Boston. Her trainer, Francisco Ramos and company, came to fight tonight. Galusian did everything she could over five rounds, but Ann Lieberman just a little bit too much. You're watching Friday Night Fights.